everyone. How are you today? By the way, this is Teacher Crystal, your teacher for today. And our subject is Listening with Speaking, Kratum 4. Now, are you ready to listen? Our lesson for today is Listen for Speakers. But before we go to our lesson, let us learn some vocabulary words for our lesson today. Are you ready to listen? These are our vocabulary words for today. First vocabulary word is Ice. Everybody say ice. What's number one again? Ice. Okay, very good. Let's spell the word ice. E Y E S. Ice. Very good. Now let's go to our vocabulary number two. Our vocabulary number two is face. What's our vocabulary number two? Face. Okay, number two, face. Let's spell the word face. F A C E. Face. What's number two? Face. Very good. Let's go to number three. Number three is mouth. Everybody say mouth. Let's spell the word mouth. M. O U T H Mouth. What's number three again? Mouth. Okay, very good. Now let's go to our and last vocabulary word. Our fourth vocabulary word is nose. What's number Four. Nose. Okay. Everybody say nose. N O S E. Nose. Those are our four vocabulary words. Now let's have a spelling activity. I hope you can remember the four vocabulary words that we have learned a while ago. Now I want you to get your notebook and your pencil. Don't forget to write the date today. 
Are you ready to listen? Listen to the audio and complete the sentences. I want you to listen to the audio and write the missing word. Use the vocabulary words that we have learned a while ago. Are you ready to listen now? Teacher Crystal will play the audio. Page 82. C. Listen and complete the sentences. 1. My face is little and round. 2. I can touch my eyes. 3. I have a long nose. 4. This is my mouth. Okay, have you written your answers already? Very good. Let's listen to the audio one more time. Okay, double check your answers. Listen and complete the sentence. Teacher Crystal will play the audio. Page 82. C. Listen and complete the sentences. 1. My face is little and round. 2. I can touch my eyes. 3. I have a long nose. 4. This is my mouth. Let's check your answers. Let's listen to the audio one more time and check your answers. Teacher Crystal will give the answer. I want you to put a check if you get the correct answer. And if you didn't get the correct answer, I want you to write the correct spelling. Okay? Teacher Crystal will play the audio. Page 82. C. Listen and complete the sentences. 1. My face is little and round. 2. I can touch my eyes. 3. I have a long nose. 4. This is my mouth. Okay, did you get all the four correct? Uh, did you get all the four answers correct? Very good. I want you to write your score on your notebook. We are going to have a listening activity. Our lesson today is we are going to listen for the speaker. But first, let us learn what is a speaker. The speaker is the person talking. There can be many speakers. And names tell who the speakers are. So in a story or in an audio, the person who is telling the story or talking in the audio, that is what you call the speaker. So it says here they can there can be many speakers. So there can be one, two, or three person talking okay uh, the speaker it uh, it can be one two or three person okay and names tell who the speakers are can you still remember names 
name start with a big letter or a capital letter. In here, in our lesson today, names, te uh, names tell who the speakers are. But in our previous lesson, names tell characters, right? The characters who are in the story. Here, names tell who the speakers are. The speaker is the person talking. Now, did you get it? What are speaker again? Speaker are the people talking in an audio or in a story. Did you get it? Very good. After activity, let's uh, try to identify the speaker in the audio. Let's have a listening activity. Are the speaker's name correct? So here, I want you to listen to the audio and identify if the name of the speaker uh, is correct. Who are speakers again? Speakers are the person who are talking in the audio. In the story, but today it's in the audio since we are going to have a listening activity. So let's choose check or X. Choose check if the name is correct, and choose X if the name names are incorrect or wrong. Remember, speakers are the names of the person who are talking. Now, are you ready to listen? Teacher Crystal will play the audio. Page 83. Listen. A. Listen. Are the speakers' names correct? Choose check or X. 1. Hello. My name is Sally. My presentation is about birds. They have good eyes. 2. Hi, Cora. This is my friend, Kenny. Hello, Kenny. Hi, Cora. Three. Hello, Grace. What do you have? Hi, Riota. It's pizza. Can I have some? Okay. Have you chosen your answers? Let's check your answers. Let's listen to the audio one more time and identify if the speaker's names are correct. Choose check or X. Are you ready to listen now? Teacher Crystal will play the audio. Page 83. Listen. A. Listen. Are the speakers' names correct? Choose check or X. 1. Hello. My name is Sally. My presentation is about birds. They have good eyes. 2. Hi, Cora. This is my friend, Kenny. Hello, Kenny. Hi, Cora. 3. Hello, Grace. What do you have? Hi, Riota. It's pizza. Can I have some? Okay, did you get all the three answers correct? The first, uh, in number one, the speaker's name is Sally. And it's a check. It's correct. For number two, the speakers' names are Cora and Kenny. And the answer is Chet. They are the speakers. And for number three, it's incorrect. The speakers' names are Craze and Risotto, right? 
And the names here written are Julie and Kazu. Write your end, I mean write your score on your notebook. Let's have another activity. Listen to the conversation funny face. What is it about? Choose the correct picture. I want you to listen to the audio. Funny face. What is the conversation about? And choose the correct picture. Is the conversation about a picture in letter A, in picture letter A? Or is it le about letter B? Are you ready to listen now? Teacher Crystal will play the audio. Page 83. B. Listen to the conversation, Funny Face. What is it about? Choose the correct picture. Funny Face. Anna and Mike make a cake. I have a banana. I can, I can make a mouth. What can you do? I have cherries, Anna. I can make eyes. I have an apple. I can make a nose. Is that a face? Yes, the cake has a face. That's funny, Mike. Let's take the cake to Jacob. What is your answer? Is it letter A or letter B? What is the conversation funny face about? Choose your answer. It's letter A. The correct answer is letter A. Did you get it right? The conversation funny face. It's letter A. Okay. Now let's have another activity. Let's answer. Now I want you to choose check or X. I want you to remember the conversation and I want you to read the sentences. If the sentence is correct or it was in the story, I want you to choose X. But if the sentence is incorrect and it was not on the story, I want you to choose Okay, circle your answer. Teacher Crystal will give you time to read each sentence and choose your answer. Funny face. Anna and Mike make a cake. I have a banana. I can make a mouth. What can you do? I have cherries, Anna. I can make eyes. I have an apple. I can make a nose. Is that a face? Yes, the cake has a face. That's funny, Mike. Let's take the cake to Jacob. Let's check your answers. Let's listen to the audio one more time and check your answers. Funny face. Anna and Mike make a cake. I have a banana. I can make a mouth. What can you do? I have cherries, Anna. I can make eyes. I have an apple. I can make a nose. Is that a face? Yes, the cake has a face. 
That's funny, Mike. Let's take the cake to Jacob. These are the correct answers. You get them right. Okay, very good. If you did not get the correct answer, I want you to circle the correct answer. Now let's go to your homework. For your homework, I want you to listen again to the audio funny face. And I want you to identify who are the speakers. Write your answer on your notebook. Don't forget to write the date today. Identify who are the speakers, the person who are talking in the conversation. Now, are you ready to listen? Teacher Crystal will play the audio. Funny face. Anna and Mike make a cake. I have a banana. I can make a mouth. What can you do? I have cherries, Anna. I can make eyes. I have an apple. I can make a nose. Is that a face? Yes, the cake has a face. That's funny, Mike. Let's take the cake to Jacob. <laughs> 